Hi, I'm Jada. I'm a student partner at Steely, and I'm going to show you guys how to use Glean. Glean is a really great app, note-taking app if you're a student or if you're just a working person and you like to type your notes. Um, it'll also record the audio for you, which is really awesome when you're going back and reviewing notes. It'll let you play the audio while also showing a description of what you typed at what moment, which is really great if you're someone who doesn't maybe not pays attention during class and you want to know what happened at what point during your notes. So let's just go through exactly what the app can do. The first thing you can do if you want to get started with Glean is just open Glean by typing in G-L-E-A-N -L dot C-O. It'll take you straight to the website. Here it'll show you most likely just basically a blank screen. The first thing you can do is add an event name. So I'll probably add just Steely Tutorial. And it'll also give you an option to import slides. Like if you're in a classroom and your professor has lecture slides that they upload previously before class, you can import them here by clicking on this button and just adding whatever document that you have in your file cabinet on your computer. And once your class starts or whatever you're trying to take notes on, if you're in a meeting or something, you can also click the record button and you can choose to record through a microphone. So that'll capture any audio coming through anywhere around your computer that can pick up or you can capture screen audio like if you're in a Zoom meeting or if you're on YouTube and you want to record that. Or it can give you the option to record both screen audio and mic. So if you want to both record the Zoom meeting possibly and any audio that's going on around you, it gives you that option as well. So to start taking notes, all you have to do is just go here to this bottom little box where it says add note. You just click there and you start typing away anything that you'd like to add. These three options will give you tags as to what you want your note to look like. For example, heading. It'll just make it into a heading and not a note with a bullet next to it. Or you can label notes as important or review. So if I have something really important to say, I will just post that by pressing the enter button is how you enter a note and it'll it'll show a little red exclamation point right next to it so when you're going back through your notes and you had something really important you needed to remember you can easily find it right there and you can also click review which is different than important if you just like want two different ways of remembering things like maybe you had let's see maybe you had like a note that the professor said that was really important like next week we have a test that's really important and so you would mark that as important and maybe something you have to review like um, say he was talking about organic chemistry functional groups and you don't know anything about those so you need to review that so you can just type organic chemistry functional groups click review and it'll post the note with like a little emoji next to it with the little sign, facial marking. That'll let you know that you need to review that. So those are like the basic notes that you can add, the basic labelings. Um, the other things that you can do with Glean that are really, really cool, you can import an image. You can import any image that you've saved from your computer or you can search an image like if I wanted to search podcast it'll use Bing to search an image and you can click on any one of these images yeah like that one will work and it'll just load onto your notes And you can also create tasks in Glean. So if you're taking notes 
and you want to add like a specific task like say your professor says that you have homework due next week Thursday you can add that as a task and it'll have a little checkbox next to it so whenever you do that you can check it off and you'll be able to keep track of tasks that way as well and similar to adding images you can also add a definition like say you're in a class and there's a really important definition like a big word you don't know let's do let's do what's a big word mitochondria yeah let's do mitochondria if i can spell that all right <laughs> it will search the definition on Wikipedia and automatically post it to your notes so you don't have to search the definition yourself and copy and paste or do anything like that. It will automatically search it and just put it on there so you can see. Nice and pretty. And there's also lightning mode on Glean where you can just quickly add things to the notes page without having to type them at the moment and you can type them later, like you can add a heading, um, the important label or the review label, and you won't have to type them in the moment if you're trying to go really, really fast and you just don't have the time at the moment and you need to do it later, for example. And those are the basic, those are the basic um, things that Glean, Glean can do. Uh, the other things that Glean can do outside of the notes, it has these little collections. So if you're in a class, for example, like I'm in material science, and so I would like to group every single note that I have for that class inside one folder. So I can make a note just like I did. I can go to these three little dots to the right. I can say move event, and I can move it to that folder. And I can do that for everything else that relates to that class as well. So I can click here to collections and everything that I put in that folder will be there and I can quickly find all the notes for that one class in that one folder and it's a really nice way to organize things within a folder. And also remember the tasks that we could create within the notes. You can find them to the left of the screen over here and it'll show you what tasks that you put down and it'll also show you which tasks that you created and it'll also sort them by date completed or date created or just alphabetically by the name um, and also another little unrelated fun thing if you go to this top bar right here you can click on this little icon of a rainbow and it'll change the color of Glee and it'll change the main color to anything you want I'm going to keep mine at purple because that's very nice to look at. Okay, this is Glean. If you're a student and you prefer to type your notes during class or if you're a working person and you just like to type your notes when you're in meetings and things, Glean is a really great app for that. It's very simple. It lets you to do a lot of things without having to think about them too much and it's very easy to organize your notes and to ask in one place.